What up? We're back here. Top Flight Aesthetics. Another video. <laughs> it's cue ball in the house with uh, Patrick Limoges yeah. over to my left. We had to uh, re-upload the videos, guys. Sorry, we had a little bit of... Uh, Technical difficulties. Yeah, we had to re-upload them. So uh, just go back, like the videos, do whatever you gotta do. But uh, starting out here, we're on TRX. It's uh, I love this machine, actually. I try to use as much as I can for abs, but... Uh, you know, the thing is, Pat, you may love it a lot, but, you know, it made me so unstable. <laughs> you know, I, I, I really don't... I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, um, basically what we're doing here is put your feet in the little loops, lower them all the way to the bottom, and you want to bring your knees to your chest. You want to get a good uh, squeeze in there. Bring your knees all the way up, and then once you can't bring them any further, try and bring your butt up a little bit basically just to like exaggerate the squeeze and uh yeah q said he was a little unstable on these just because it is a difficult workout for you know how out. it made me feel it made me feel like i was like a monkey trying to hump a football <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's how hard it is yeah but it is a hard workout to uh start off with because it's putting all your body weight right in your feet but um like i'm doing here you kind of want to just be stable and bring your butt up like i said like just exaggerate the squeeze at the top and uh, to challenge the, yourself more, walk yourself further out, like bring your arms further forward. So uh, it's like almost more of a stretch. It's more challenging. But um, like you said, since you were having trouble with it, we could uh, next time what we're going to do, Q's form got a little bad towards the end, as you can see. Um, oh my God. <laughs> next time you can just do mountain climbers. So your feet are on the ground, no TRX at all. And you're just alternating knees to your chest, just boom, boom, boom. Uh, basically the same concept is just bringing your knees to your chest. Is there any uh, benefit uh, from doing one leg versus two leg? No, not really. Honestly, it's more of like a cardio workout when you're doing the mountain climbers because you can go so much quicker, you mm -hmm. know. But, um, yeah. Yeah, I know. Uh, now we're on to uh, crunches. Just, wow. Yep. Medicine. That was incredible. Uh, sink, 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 we sink. are just impeccable, folks. <laughs> um, but we're doing medicine ball crunches here. The crunch and a sit-up. Big uh, common misconception. Two different things. Sit up, you're coming all the way up, you know, at one point there is, you know, tension, you're squeezing your muscles, and when you come all the way up, you're almost relaxed, all the way back down. Crunches, the point of these is basically, if I can explain simply, you're shortening the space from the top of your chest, look at me, I was, I was twerking here. <laughs> we're again for the twig. What song was on? This is the key part. Was a song. Um, um, it was a She Wolf in the Closet. Yes, yeah, she, she Wolf in the Closet. That song was a great song. But um, like I was saying, you want to shorten the length from your chest to the like your your uh, hips, basically where your abs are. You're shortening them with the crunch. So come together, shortening the muscle. See, I'm not sitting all the way up. I'm just focusing on that squeeze, and I'm breathing out on the top, just making sure I get like that squeeze in. You know, Pat, uh, why does it feel like, for me, I felt like I was going to fall off the first time I did it. Why is it, is that better that you're on something that's not Um stable? Yeah, well, we did the medicine ball because it throws off the stability of the whole thing. You know, you're not on, like, a solid surface. You're shaking around, so you also need to keep your core tight the whole time, which is good. It furthers, uh, makes the workout even harder. But um, if you felt you're falling off, just kind of put the medicine ball further up your back. So, like, when you're laying down, it would be up on your back more rather like, more, like, your more, more towards your like your yeah exactly like, more towards your shoulders so it just gives you like more stability on the back so you can't like rock and fall off the ball you know okay but uh next here i don't even know what you'd call these honestly we're just going uh knee to elbow it gets your obliques or the side of your abs really good the uh, whole workout is trying to stay in like perfect plank form or push-up form and you want to just bring your knee to the side of your elbow you're not bringing elbow it forward planks. something like that yeah you're not bringing <laughs> it forward like straight to your chest you're bringing it on the outside and touching your elbow uh, really good for the obliques, and then we're coming back right at the obliques on the next workout with the Russian twist. Wow, that's a yes, that's a European twist. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> but yeah, we're doing the Russian twist on the bench. You can do it on the ground, but I do it on the bench with the weight because one, again, the stability is there, so you always have to keep your core tight no matter what. There's no point of the workout; you can just relax because your feet are in the air. You got to keep your core tight the uh, whole time, and the weight can go further than the ground and get an even better twist or uh, range of motion on it. You'll see right here, I'm using the uh, the medicine ball, and the reason is because Pat was doing 25 his first set, and I didn't want to go so hard because we had just done a circuit, um, and uh, obviously I don't want to kill myself, so I went and grabbed a 20-pound uh, medicine ball, but I, thought, I discovered that it was like too big and it yeah, was like, like bulky it was way too bulky and it was made me completely unstable so that's why you'll see me in the next set with two two tens yeah because the first time you didn't want to use two tens i mean kind of weird to hold two tens yeah, so on the medicine ball but it's so big like the 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 plate here the 45 plate is too big too like you can see it's like 
it just gets in the way. The whole point of the exercise is that like fluid range of motion and you're going past where the ground would be because the bench is there. So it's just to get that long range of motion and the big 45 or the medicine ball almost kind of like defeats the purpose of that. So he went to the two tens here and you can see how much like more fluid it, it looks. It works a lot better, honestly. It, feel, it looks better. I mean, I'm sure it felt better too. Uh, honestly, I felt like I was going to fall off the first yeah. time. And, like, well, it's so big, you know, you want the weight there, but if it's that big and it's like throwing everything off, I mean. Then it just, you don't want Yeah, that. I use the two tens. Um, for the 45, when I was in the 45, like you saw, um, that was my last set. I went too hard. I honestly should have just like, I up the reps or, you know, held you know, go two, big, go big or won't, hold two forty fives, that would be weird. Or maybe get a kettlebell kettle kettlebell. Wow. Whoa. 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 Tug <laughs> twister. Kettlebell. D- tug twister. Just because it can be heavier but smaller, you know. But um going to knee raises here on just like uh, I don't even know what you'd call them. Where the T R X was, but we put our uh Hanger elbow things. Yeah, I can't think of it. Jesus. I don't know. But um knee raises just bring a knee to your chest. If you wanna further workout or make it harder bring your knees all the way up and then like roll your hips forward but uh you see me here slapping cues like abs or poking his abs that was because he was swinging too much so i just it really made, wanted to really made a difference by yeah the way. i just wanted him to like concentrate on that squeeze you know so i was just tapping his abs making sure he's squeezing them but uh yeah that concludes the video guys so again like comment subscribe let us know what show you your friends show your family <laughs> let us know what you're gonna see next uh thanks for watching peace